There's been more than 28,000 HFMD cases in Singapore so far this year, about double the number seen in the same period last year. But Singapore Polytechnic's Dr Tan Eng Lee hopes to make a difference. The 33-year-old took two months to come up with a reagent that's able to cut short the time taken to detect HFMD. This is added to clinical samples like blood, stools or those taken through mouth swabs. In just two hours, doctors can tell if the patient has HFMD and the strain of enterovirus 71. Dr Tan says it's a breakthrough as the fastest test currently can take up to 12 hours. We hope that we can, through this detection kit, we can um, break the transmission earlier and also can the clinicians are able to administer the treatment at a much earlier stage. But there's a catch. The invention is most effective when a child has developed HFMD symptoms like ulcers in the mouth, commonly seen four to six days from the onset of the disease. As such, doctors say the invention is most useful when seeking confirmation that a patient is suffering from HFMD. But Dr Tan says early diagnosis can prevent complications. The enteroviruses can, um, especially the strain 71 type, can potentially lead to um, complications. It could be a brain, brainstem inflammation or even um, accumulation of fluid in the lungs. So, and it can be fatal to the children. So we will always try to detect these particular viruses fast enough to, you know, in the event to prevent it from these complications from happening. The invention has caught the eye of a US-based biomedical company, which has inked a licensing agreement with the Polytechnic. The plan is to commercialise the invention in Singapore and Asia-Pacific, where HFMD is said to be most prevalent. When rolled out next year, the test will only be available in Singapore hospitals. But the long-term plan, Dr Tan says, is to make it available off the shelves as well.